Hi, I'm Dr. Stephen Brazis, and I'm here today with two of my colleagues and very good friends, Dr. Locke Johnson and Dr. Michael Phelps. We're here today to discuss some questions pertaining to the oral surgery field of dentistry, which many of my patients have asked over the years. So, uh, Michael, I'll ask you uh, this next question. What uh, is nerve damage? Uh, nerve damage typically refers to trauma to the nerves of the maxillofacial region. Uh, many times we will uh, encounter the intraalveolar nerve as our primary concern, which is a sensory nerve that gives sensation to the lip and chin. The incidence is fairly low, but we do encounter it in situations where we remove impacted wisdom teeth, uh, especially in patients whose teeth have fully formed and sometimes with uh, patients who've had dental implant treatment. We will many times see it as well uh, in a small percentage of patients who have jaw reconstructive surgery uh, for advancement of their lower jaw to a proper occlusion. Okay, and if uh, you're talking about extractions with nerve damage, uh, do you encounter more of a risk with upper or lower teeth, or does it matter? Uh, the lower teeth are the concern, specifically. Maxillary teeth, the upper teeth, uh, not really have any nerve structure close to them that would be of concern. It's the mandibular uh, wisdom teeth are our primary concern. Great. All right. Well, I want to thank both you, uh, Dr. Johnson and Dr. Phelps, for joining me today. Thanks, Steve. And for sharing your expertise with me and with our watchers out there. And I want to thank all of you for joining us today. I hope you found this discussion useful. I'd like to encourage you to check out more of my videos at www.totellthetooth.com. Please also check out my office website for general dentistry at www.toothhaven.com. Until then, this is Dr. Stephen Brazis wishing you all the best of oral and general health.